Okay, I'm going to point out a few different uh, elements of our ion source, at least from the external view. Uh, what you see here is just the holder that holds the prism, and you can see there's a little light bulb that's right under this cap. And that light bulb actually sends light through the prism, through this lens, and onto the multi plate so we can put a camera on the plate and visualize the spot. So this is our one focusing element, and I'm not going to move it, but if you would rotate it, the lens would focus in and out. This is an identical focusing ring and optical um, mount here for a second laser that we don't have on this particular system. On this side of this flange is a piece of tubing that is mounted on a flange that is used to add additional gas if one wants to do collisional activation dissociation. The Molly plate, which is in the system right now, is positioned about where my hand is, but it's in the middle of this um, manifold chamber. On this side of the chamber is our interlock box that is used to take the plate in and out of the mass spectrometer. This box will be pumped out of atmospheric pressure to allow the inner trap door to open and then the plate will be pulled in by this retractor arm into this chamber. Then the pressure will be equalized and this trap door will open up and the plate can be ejected. This digital motor is for the x-axis motion of the plate. Since the laser beam is not moved, it's actually the plate. And there's another Y dimension, digital motor, and uh, assembly position down here.